Matthew, Matthew, oh, Matthew, Matthew, Matthew. You're, that's probably an anomaly field. You probably don't want to go in there. Oh. I am not sure if I'll be able to... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, your ragdolling body was so good. <laughs> no. I'm not playing Fan Forces. I won't ever play Phantom Forces. I won't play a Roblox game, but you know what? This isn't Roblox. I know, it looks like Roblox. You run around, it feels like Roblox, but it's not Roblox. This is Stallcraft, which is funny because that obviously is a, a nod to Minecraft, but the game doesn't even look like Minecraft. It just has funny people with square heads. Stallcraft, a Stalker themed MMO RPG FPS where you run around and you feel super tactical and then you see your buddy running beside you and you realize just how dumb you look as you play the game with tech trees and actually a very solid progression system and a very solid market and economy and the best part it's free this is free to play on Steam you can download it right now and you're in you're able to play the game it's pretty good so we're gonna be trying it out for the first day in the first part of this episode, in the latter part, we're gonna be doing some PvP. So, I'm gonna make that into different chapters so you can click wherever you like. Hopefully you had a good new year. And uh, yeah, have fun. Um, I'm a few hours in. I've got a character with like a level, eh, basically like a third tier uniform. I've got like a second tier gun and a crappy sawed off shotgun that I need to replace pretty soon because it is not great. It does barely any damage. But, uh, the game starts you off in the swamps. You start off as either a bandit or a loner. And I chose to go bandit because it said that eventually you can go into the mercs, which I wanted to join. I just got back from the stalker shoot, so... I I've, I've been around a lot of people dressed as high-tech mercs, you know? Mercs with a lot of cash. But, uh... Yeah, I don't know if I'll upload the exploring the nuclear power plant video before or after this. But we'll see, depending on what happens today. There's a lot of little public events that occur. You can actually see like that dogged in, you can see kind of flashing over there. That means that players of some faction are over there working on that objective, which is always a kind of spooky ambient thing. That players are always doing something in this area. Um, so the dogs are somewhere around here. I don't know. Oh, there's a dead guy. This might be my quest. Yep. Bandit's corpse. You see the corpse of a stalker in a bandit suit. The poor bastard has been gnawed on by dogs. He's clutching a white case tightly. This mu must be what ear wants. This is what's cool. Is that I'm out here in the zone doing my own thing. Doing quests and such. But what's really spooky about it is that the loner camp is just down there. And the bandit camp is just up here. And usually in every place, like Cordon, Loner Camp, Bandit Camp. So somewhere in the middle, you'll find PvP. And if you go closer to the Loner Camp, you'll get into more dangerous areas. You don't lose everything, though, when you die. So it's kind of a lightweight PvP system. Like, if you die, it's not that big of a deal. You lose any loot on you, but you don't lose your weapon, your uniform, your night vision goggles or any ammo that's not unpacked. So any ammo that is packed is like stored. It's locked on you. I can go to my ammo here. You can see it does not drop upon death. But then stuff like grenades drops upon death. These two medkit stacks drop upon death, but not the last one. So the game is, um, and also quest items don't drop upon death. Just loot. Loot and open bullets, basically, drop upon death. But we got that, uh, we got that bandit discovered, so let's go back and turn this quest in. See how much loot we get. How much how much grub we get for doing this one. Yeah, so here's like the bandit camp. Look at this. There's a whole bandit camp. There's people sitting beside fires. There's people up. I mean, that's a player right there. There's players running around. They look like Minecraft. There's that guy. He's, um, he is, uh, gay, literally, and will try to flirt with you all the time. Uh, there's this man with a Mosin infantry. Look at <laughs> He's looking at me. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. I can see his mouse moving up and down. Um, yeah. 
multiplayer stalker game. There's multiple instances. There's not just one, so I don't know how many servers there are total, but my two buddies happened to join the same one earlier. Um, oh, wow. I got quite a bit for that. I got parts. I got rubles. Okay, cool. Yeah, you also gain reputation. The more quests you do around a certain area, like this is the boathouse um, area, the more quests you do, the more you rank up the like town, and then you can buy better items. This is a really cool system, in my opinion. And it's pretty easy to get along. It's kind of grindy, but if I sort by, let's say, submachine guns, I can buy right now an AEK Cashton or a Walther MPK. I can also, because I'm level 2, level 3, I can buy a mini Uzi. I wonder if that's a pistol slot. That'd be kind of nice. And then if I go to the area in Cordon, which is called Photon, and I do nothing there, I can just be there. It's a little bit higher end of an area, so I'm able to get better weapons. And you can upgrade from weapon to weapon. I don't think you can skip. You can't buy like a Keter without buying the AK-91K. So it's kind of like a MMO in a way. You don't just save up for things. You have to go up the tree and basically upgrade your setups as you go. But look, there's a Spectre M4. Is that a Thompson? What is that thing? Open preview. Look at this. You can preview your guns. You can see it says clip. That is disgusting. You can see like you can look look you can see the customization options. Look at all the sights, man. Oh, okay. That's actually pretty good. Suppress Oh my god. I have to have it. I have to have it. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, let's go to uh, here. I'll show you guys assault rifles. Like right now, I'm running a, a, I'm running this AKS, so I can go look at the stats too. You can see all these different stats. You can see like a battlefield sim thick damage drop off sort of thing. How cool! Look at all that. Open preview. Look at this. You can customize so much stuff. DTK. That's called MBC. I don't know. Uh, look at all these. Look at that. Ah, it's so good. I can put a, I can put a hammer scope, all the way up there somehow. I don't know how you would utilize that, but that's just kind of funny. Drum mag, RK2 grip, look at this. And they actually all do things too. Recoil minus 2%, recoil minus 3%, so there is a meta. There is a meta here. You're not gonna get it immediately though, you do have to grind. But check that out. Look at that, <laughs> that's the grossest AKS I've ever seen. Let's go to the high end stuff, let's go to M4s. Old HKG3, L85, M16. Oh, looks like the M16A3 is the uh, newest one you can get. You can get a quad rail handguard. All right, we're getting into the battlefield territory now. <gasps> you can get an M203? Look at that. Imagine having this <laughs> get up and stalker. <laughs> All right, snipers. We got to go look at snipers. You start off with the Mosins. Uh, you get M70s, SVTs, Steyr Scout. M40 A5s, oh. L96A1, SVU, VSS, yeah, dude, there's some cool stuff. So yeah, that's that's the, sorry, I just got a little bit sucked up into the weapons there. But uh, I think I've got some quests, yeah, I've got some quests off in Cordon, so I'm gonna head that way, and hopefully we can make it there safely. Looks like some people are taking us dogged in. Let me double check how much ammo I've got. Oh yeah, I've got quite a bit. We've got a lot. We've got a bunch of ammo. We're good to go. Oh, I still have this explorer suit on me. I definitely need to put that in my storage. I don't need it anymore. I thought I got rid of it when I upgraded to uh, the suit I'm wearing right now. I'm wearing a picklock suit, which gives me a lot of resistance to, like, more anomalous things. There's different types, different trees of suits that you can get. And uh, some of them are more protective towards bullets. Some of them are more protective towards radiation. And my buddy Josh told me that areas far up north are really, really heavy in radiation, so you kind of want a mixture of both. Oh, I got a little bit lost there. And uh, so I got, I went through the combo um, subtree of uniforms, which eventually led me, I'm on level three of that, and led me to this pick lock. What is that slot for? I don't know. This slot's for grenades. Is that what I equip when I equip four? Oh, okay, I see. Interesting game. Very cool, let's get some action. Let's go see if we can kill some loners or get killed by some loners. And I think the server system sort of works in a, I guess an auto-balancing fac fashion? fashion.
because I haven't really seen many servers that I've jumped on where that's a friendly um, where like one team was overwhelmingly controlling the area I've uh, oh it's a little piano I've just seen pretty balanced gameplay where there is a little bit, bit of PvP in each map between the bases, but in terms of one team like ransacking the other, haven't really seen it yet. I don't know what group size you can get. It looks like it's about four from what I've seen just with like the little party system, but who knows? It could be bigger than that. Some of these uh, mutant remains are left over by AIs that fight the mutants, and then the AIs don't loot them, so you can grab the loot pretty quickly. There is so much to this map. So this is the, the swamps area. There's Chernobyl 4, I guess. Cordon's up here. It's a little different, obviously. There's some of the similarities. There's like kind of like the loner village, which is technically that is a loner village, but the loners spawn over here in the garages. Um, you can see... I forgot what this place is called. That's not Dark Valley. This is Dark Valley up here. Oh, what's that place called? It's called something weird. Like, it's not wild territory. It's not Dark Valley. I don't know. But, uh... Yeah, there's the dump, which is garbage. You can see the big barn and garbage. Agriprom, it's got the same kind of road layout. They're all a little bit different. Like, there's some compounds and stuff. But uh, as you go farther north, things start to get really cool. The pit. Don't even know what this place is supposed to be. But it looks neat. Looks like some bridges over probably very radiated water. As you go north, you get bloodsuckers. You get more dangerous mutants and stuff. You have the forest over here. No clue what that place is. You have the graveyard. Um, radar, which looks like a big urban area with whatever that is. Army warehouses, you've got the Freedom Base, I guess, is somewhere in there. I don't know. Oh, there's the Duty Base. I don't know where the Freedom Base is, though. But, uh, you got Dead City over here. Really excited to find that one. That one looks super cool. And then you've got the Merc Base, which is what my goal is. I want to join the Mercenaries. So, we're going to have to go to Dead City, find the Mercenaries, and join them. Then, up here, there's three big areas. Sorry, had to check if I was going to get killed or not. Lemansk, Red Forest, and Yanov. I mean, look at the detail on these maps. Such a cool-looking map system that they've got in this game. Oh, they're kissing. How cute. So when you enter an area, you have 12 seconds of invulnerability. You can't be sniped, you can't be shot at. We're gonna try to go straight north from here and hit up the bandit camp in the cordon because don't want to run into any players. This is a pretty big choke point though where players do camp, so we gotta be careful. Looks like I got some friendlies up ahead though. That's a good sign. They haven't been raided too hard yet. I haven't gone up there before. Kind of a spooky game to be playing solo. I was playing it with uh, Josh and Viper earlier. Now to be solo, it's a bit different feeling. There's these AI. Spooky sounds behind me. Yeah, you can loot random stuff in the zone. You can loot boxes, crates. Look at this, there's a whole scene of gamers. Looks like they're talking. Grenade? You okay, bud? These old silos. It's really cool what artists can do when limited with, you know, a low polygon environment. It also makes for very good frames. I have the game capped at 200 FPS right now. And my PC is absolutely vibing at that FPS. Oh, maybe this other stalker is doing the same thing. I don't know where he just ran. If I can... Okay, they're shooting over here. Distress call. Oh, crap. Angie rats. Let's go see what the distress call. Ooh. Ooh, rain. It hasn't rained in the game for me yet. This is cool. I noticed them jerk. Oh shoot. There's pigs too. There's pigs. There's pigs. Woo. 
shoot. Are those I all? The enemy. Oh crap. I think those guys are players and they might be armored. So I really need to watch out. I don't know if they're shooting at me still. Some assholes ahead. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna back out. That's two players. I don't know what they've got. Here's another player. I'm gonna go group up with him. Ooh, hello, anomaly. Bit of a sketchy situation there. If the AI had stayed alive, I would have joined, but I could not tell if those were players. They were both armored, which means they both had better gear than I did. I don't want to mess with that too much. Sound effects are nice for the rain. Oh, hello, pig. He just gets sucked up in the anomaly? It looks like he did. Are you gonna get exploded by the tornado thing? Come on, buddy. Come get me. Oh, it killed him. <laughs> I wish it kind of spun him around like the old ones. Okay. There. The stalker camp over here is gone, so that means that bandits must have cleared it out. Some mutant remains there. Gunshots. It's in this barn. I think it's people. I think it's the same group. I'm gonna flank them. Got one. I'm just gonna toss a grenade on him. Ooh! Ouch! I'm gonna back up from that. He's using a shotgun. Going for his friend? Yes, got him. Okay, gotta make sure there's no others. Whew, okay. Need loot and scoot. I don't know what's really worth it to grab on these guys. Probably just stuff like that. Um, this guy probably doesn't have crazy stuff to Ooh, that's interesting. Yeah, I don't know what to grab. I don't know what's worth it and what's not now. Some bread. Some bullets. The guy was just working off shotgun, nothing else. Okay, I'm gonna run. There's apparently a stash over here. Some bullets. Stash is inside. Yeah, that was fun. Got to flank some stalkers. If the guy didn't use a shotgun, especially a sawed-off shotgun, I'd probably be very, very dead right now. But he chose to only fight with the shoddy. Maybe he was out of ammo. Oh, there is a fight. They're probably loners. Can I get up on this train area? Can I peek over? Not easily, it seems. <laughs> Goodbye. Oh my gosh. Got one. Those are AI, I'm pretty sure. I just need to go, yeah, that, that's a bandit doing the same quest I am. Ooh, hello. Suppressed, I think? Alright, let's get down there. You heal, in my opinion, a little too fast. The healing is really quick. Oh, this is interesting. Little cave. Oh, this is cool. 
tons of first aid kits, but I can't actually grab them. I wish I could. Someone died here. Okay, let's get out. I'm scared. I don't like this place. That was a player. I think that was the same player I killed earlier. It is. And there's his friend. Oh, no. No. Holy crap. That's a bit of boys. Oh, they're coming. Oh my gosh. Whoa. That one's armored. Can I just go? Can I just can I just run? Whew. Oh my gosh. Hello. <laughs> Do they is this like Fall to Vegas where they're gonna come in, in a second and kill me? I guess not. I guess I'm safe. Hello. Oh, Боже. Спасибо тебе, парень. Ты... All right, well, we did that quest. We got ourselves some loot. Yeah, we got ourselves actually a good bit of stuff just from doing that. Killing that one little stalker camp. Just wonder if I can get revenge on those two guys again. I wonder if I can find them and ambush them. Because seriously, I bet I could. It was not too hard to kill them the first time. Only reason he got me that second time was... I thought he would have his shotgun out again, so I was just doing this big, obtrusive peek. Like, hmm. Alright. I cut the ear off. I got some reward of some sort, maybe? I don't know. Maybe we can go sell our stuff back at Photon 2. Uh, I have to go down to below the bridge, like right below where it says Same. the cordon. I have to go there. Same. Or do you have to go, Matthew? I have to go right above where it says the cordon. Okay, we can go Matthew's first, and then... I know I also, where he has to go. I also have to go, like, just northwest of the cordon name. I Yeah, is it for the pharmacist stash? No, it's for Brigadier, which is in the compound just northwest of that. Okay. Alright, careful. The boar hideout at 106 bearing is probably hostile. And that's only well, we need to go away. past it. So the, the village to our southeast, I need to go in there. It's also usually hostile, uh, in terms mm -hmm. of players nearby. So come up this way then. I'm gonna I'm gonna flank a little bit to the right. Oh, I walked also, in a crusher. I just got a player nearby notification. Yeah, don't walk don't walk in that, Matthew. That's not a fun one. That's run away. Turn around and run away. Turn around and run away. Turn around and run away. Uh oh. Dead. Uh -oh. Matthew's dead. <laughs> I noticed a couple of bodies. There's some guys down at the train tracks. Found some remains. I have to clear this uh, train track. Careful, area. there's mines. Yep, I know. Uh, I don't oh, know. Wait, what player, I have player, to player. Do. Damn, I missed. Uh, Josh, could I get help? Yep, moving, moving, moving. Oh, moving. I didn't know you guys were still back there. Shit. I'm running back just a little bit. Oh, she tossed some grenades at me! Where the hell is he? The man tossed a grenade up at me. He's right but down below, I think. There's two. Killed one. I One's really hurt. He's Damn it. He's running. No, pass got him. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, I'm stuck. Ooh. Okay. Dude, I it's nailed down. this guy. Oh. All he had was... Oh, jeez. Oh, that was it. Uh, where's that voice coming from? Inside here? Yep. Oh, there's a dead band. Uh, I have to go to the little place next uh, to the south. Oh, I have to find all the hostages in here. Whoa. Okay. Is there another one? Oh, yep, there's... There he is. Okay. Okay, I'm, I'm I'm good. I can leave this okay, place now. Okay, come with me, come with me. Yep, yep, I gotta go. Probably same place. Dude, I hit that guy one shot, expanding. Dope. Now we know. Oh. Oh, homie, careful. Okay, yeah, I've got nothing else. Um, I do have oh, something. Oh, soccer camp, right right behind us, soccer camp. Let's clear this real fast and then run back uh, north. Uh, actually, okay. follow me. I've got to go north. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'll mark a... That guy on the right. 
shoot. Down them. How do I get down? To the right. I'm oh. getting shot from my right. I'm down! I'm down! Guy on me! Guy on me! Shotgun coming, guy! Shotgun coming, guy! Coming, 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 coming. Right here, right here, right here, right here. He's on you, he's I on you. I him. I hit him, I hit him, hit him. He's yeah, down. He's, he's dead, he's dead, he's dead. He's dead. He's come, dead. Come, come revive me, come revive me. Oh, I, he was he's running dead. to push Matthew and I nailed him. All he had yeah, was he, three he shotgun me shots otherwise. on him. He slid right next to me. <laughs> oh. oh, right side. Shotgun. Behind me, behind me, behind me. Shit. Where at? Where at? I don't know. No, exactly. I killed a player. Push through this quick. Push through it quick. Push through it quick. We need to go quick. There's something behind us. Go, go, go. Push, 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 push. What's this? Is there a player dead on the left here? Yeah. That was a guy that I shot. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Okay, we're clear. Oh, we can loot that thing and then we run. Loot that green. Okay, we're out. Go, 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 go. Um, go home, go home. I have to go, I have to go bearing tin. Hey, look, another stalker camp. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> let's, let's get away from here first. <laughs> let's get back on our side of town. We can, we, we can hit the boar hideout on the way back. Yo, look at those pigs. I, I grabbed, uh, I looted that guy a little bit. Oh yeah, cool. Yeah, we'll we'll go grab that. Oh wait, those were the boars from from miles the thing. Away. Yeah. Uh, this might be a fight. I think it sounds like AI. This AI, a it's boars. a friendly AI shooting. Uh, he's shooting something really far. Oh, it's uh, it's ledges. Any player? Any player far away? Got it. On the in the middle of the road. Middle of the road. Got it. I'm pushing up right. He left of the road. Got it. Like, I'm pushing right. Yep, I see him. Oh, I'm dead. I see the end. Got one. I'm continuing my right flank. Shoot, there's gunshots everywhere. I don't know where that shooter is. You know, Josh? Nope. I thought it was the guy that I was looking at, yeah, but apparently it wasn't there's him. Two. Oh, I got him. Uh, we were both staring at each other. I, f I shot first. I got him. Okay, well, there's one more guy down there. I'm coming back to grab my shit. How do you know? Uh, because it wasn't the guy who killed me. Oh, or, that, no, Well, okay. that was the guy who killed me, but the guy who killed me wasn't the guy that I was looking at. I killed two. I just killed two. Oh, okay. Then they're all dead. Oh, no, 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 no. You good, Matthew? Yeah, I just anomaly. Okay. I don't mind. I don't know if it's a crusher or a trampoline, but... Dude, like Mosins are like that's so scary. Mm-hmm. Wait till you see the other sniper rifles that can one shot to the body. Oh, uh, so it's just blocky stalker. Yeah, blocky stalker. Oh, shots south one five two. I don't know what that is. I'm gonna peek it now. Oh, gosh. Whoa, whoa. Was that at me? Matthew, just I don't know what's going on. Yep, there's a Mosin sniper south. Watch out. I'm looking Directly for him. South? Yes, I'm looking for him. I can't see I'm him. I'm gonna bait him. Oh wait, I see him. Oh, I just saw him. I'm trying to mark, mark. Hit him once. Damn it. Oh, he got picked up by an anomaly. I got him, got him. This shit pushing. Another one, another one. Marking, Beware. marked. Got him. Oh my God, he's gaming. There's another, wait, there's another one, right? Oh no, that's a flash. Uh, there's Dude, a Drew's... few bodies around there. <laughs> if you want to go check those bodies, I'm go standing. Ahead, I'm standing on one of them. I'm yeah. covering. Dude, bush camping is legitimately the best way because people don't see movement or the lack of movement. That guy ran back for his body. There, he had nothing on him coming to okay. you. I know there's another body somewhere around there, like another body bag, but uh, let's just get Why out of here. Wait? No, yeah, let's get the fuck out I, of here. I let's, definitely... go get, let's, let's go get clean so that we don't care if we die. Yeah, I agree. I've got tons of stuff. I, this is what the title of the video is going to be, Josh. 
multiplayer stalker is already here, comma, again. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the, to be fair, this is closer to stalker. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's go, get go, it? let's go get that one. One, two, four. Hit that and then hit the stalker. Oh, there's a camera. friendly there. It might be him, maybe? Nah, he's miles away. Watch out, there's a lot of anomalies on this hill. Right over, right where we're running, I think there's one. Never mind. It's in the middle of the road. Watch out, anomaly right in front of you. Yep. There's no gunshots. Uh, watch another. out, this is where the sniper fight was. This is where the snipers all were. The boars look uninterrupted. Yeah, they do. All right. Yeah. You got it, that was it. Weird, okay. Crossing? I'm gonna just... Oh, no, 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 across, across, Beware. across. Marked. Enemy. Moving left. Moving on him. Yep, he doesn't know we're here. I hit him once. He's at six, six tenths health. Nice. Whoa. Whoa. You careful, good? careful. You guys are just pushing right into where those enemies just were. Careful, careful. Okay. We need to go this way. <laughs> You can just stab the these. We can just stab these for stealth. Bit. Just let let them bite you. Literally let them come up to your toes and bite you. Cause they do one percent damage. There's dogs here too. They're 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 pushovers too. Uh, the dogs, the pseudo dogs, you can't stab easily. The dogs, you can. Yeah, I've got to hang on. There's I got a quest right here. I gotta talk to this guy. Yeah, talk to this guy on the other side of the Wait, don't go there. Don't go there. Oh, no, no, oh. no, 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 no. Yo, let's go. Yes, sir. Let's, yes, sir. Oh, no. Oh, he's dead. <laughs> he's dead. <laughs> oh, true, no. Oh, oh true. Uh, I should be able to get out. Nope. You're dead. Devices. Oh, it's so cheap. Oh, my God. What, the metal detector? Yeah, it's so cheap. Or the Sega? Bro, it's no, so bad. cheap. Did you hear him the first time? My bad. Yo, did you just explode the trader because it was so cheap? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro, I'm so excited. Josh threw a grenade on the trader. It's like, bro, it was this, an accident. This is such a good deal. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir, for you your business. You can't be real. You can't be real.